welcome to a next fest demo of the last Ori crew final cut. I have not uh, seen any footage of this, played it at all. Uh, but this is co-op, and uh, we can play it alone. I'm just going to have a look at the game, so I will be playing it by myself. So let's start a new game. Stories for players who want a less challenge. Yeah, that's me. I want stories. The items you can find in the game that will heal you slowly over time. So this is an RPG. And it's uh, set in medieval times. So it looks kind of good, actually. From the, the previews and the pictures that I saw on Steam. There was Lido. Okay, okay. We shall be waiting. Hello. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, my head. Oh, God. Oh shit! Oh! Oh my god! Oh! I must be dreaming! I must be dreaming! Come on! Get me out! Get me out! Help! Help! No! 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 What the heck is that thing? Can you hear me? I'm your... And I'm so glad that you're up. Navigator, keep the darkness of the space. And don't you worry, I'll take care of you. Your systems are rebooting now. But first, keep your eyes open. We have been rebooted. A mission. So let's and take you home. First, you need to find me. Just look for a pit. I'm a goddess living in their water. The lady of the lake. In the Don't trust anybody except me. I don't want to trust you. You can't speak in full sentences. It's a non-linear narrative experience that I can read. Also, if you want to read it. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. Oh, the details are exquisite. Weakling arose after all. We had our doubts. You'd I would blame that malfunctional belt of yours. Yet you seem fully operational now. Go and start paying your debt. What? I'm not dead? I had this horrible nightmare and it felt so real. 
But hallucinations are a perfectly normal symptom of a long sleep of the ascended. So how can I know you're not a hallucination yourself? Who are you anyway? I am Maltus, patriarch of the Keepers. We will explain everything in good time. Come back later if you have questions. Now we need you to cooperate. Cooperate? Yes. You will proceed to Tobias for training. Like now? I mean, everything is still a little fuzzy. I would appreciate some time to... We would appreciate your immediate compliance. Without perfecting your hand-to-hand -hand combat skills, you will be doomed to perpetual death, which... Hold on there. What? Perpetual death? Indeed. You bear the gift of immortality, hence... Immortality? So, I can't die. If you'd allowed me to finish, kind of you would have already known. No. You die ordinarily. Oh. Then you are born again. Such is the power of the belt you carry. We are analyzing it, and don't have validated outputs to share with you yet. What? That's all you have to say here? Yes. Now go and meet Tobias already. My servant will show you the way. Oh, just one more thing before you go. We shall call you Silver, our regular naming proto- What? No, my name is- Oh, shit. I honestly have Ocean. no yeah, idea. Totally Yet agree. we do. Silver was the only name available on your Christum. The naming protocol says it will have to suffice. I would much rather pick my name- Enough! We won't bend the principles that keep our world in order. But... Humans. Yeah. Always disrespectable of the it? habits and Kids. cultures of others. The rat company will suit you. Hey, you rat. The main character is already annoying the crap out of me. He's a whiny. Annoying. Snowflake. Oh my lord. I think this is, must be the worst main character I've ever played in my life. I wanted to kill him already. Can't you see they're obviously getting a raw deal here? Well, they're rats. Nobody's gonna cook for them. Ha ha ha. Funny. You know that's most likely why he was stealing food in the first place. Where is your sense of justice? Are you really trying to give me a sense of justice talk because I did the right thing and reported a theft? Why can't you be rational about this? I honestly think we have enough of our own problems here, like finding our spaceship and getting out of here. Oh, so now you are suddenly sure we have a spaceship. Well, no, but it's only logical. We couldn't have just appeared here out of thin air. Um, hello? Why like baby that is guy. Here. Great to meet you, man. Ah, sorry. My manners. It's Brian. Silver, likewise. It's comforting to know that I'm not alone in this... mess. You're not. I'm Petra. Silver. Well, Silver. Now you know everyone worth knowing around here. Oh, come on. Marco? <laughs> True, he is a bit of an a-hole, but he's one of us. Great. Well, tell me everything. That spaceship, for instance. Honestly, we don't know much either. We all got the same briefing. Go and start paying your debt. Training. Now. <laughs> same for you? That's actually pretty accurate. Right, so you'd really better go now. If Tobias sees us delaying your training session, he will get pretty pissed. Brian is right. They take things quite seriously around here. But let's talk later. Tobias won't talk to you forever. Can't wait. Well, let's do this. See you soon, guys. See you, Silver. I'm I'll be somewhere far Petra away from this prejudiced hypocrite. Character. Oh, come on. Can't we just... Can we just kill Silver, please? He's, he's annoying me. Ugh. I really hope they give you an option. Last of the Ori crew. Spidey, baby. Oh, lowly. I always forget. I, I shouldn't. Uh, never mind. Just call me Silver. Loaded. 
I'm sorry you had to suffer the smell of those stinky rat asses along your way, Ascended One. We're short of ends these days. I'm Tobias. My meagre self will be responsible for your training. We will follow standard protocols and have you ready shortly. Right, that dreamy glowing stick behind you will be a part of the training too. The mighty rod of lightning? No, it certainly will not. I might not be the most competent teacher, but I can tell the limits of my pupils. And I will make yeah. you die with some dignity. Not just by accidentally frying yourself. Let me know when you're ready. I'll provide you with one lucky spar rat. Sure. I'd rather not die at all. So, training. How do we start? First, find yourself a sword in the armory. I won't bother you with another ratchet to lead you. It's easy to find. You just need to go back through the same passageway by which you came here. It's at my right hand. Once you're at the end of it, turn right. It's the first door just around the corner. There is a giant shield above, easy to spot. Equip yourself there and come back. Okay, open the pause menu to access the map. Switch between points of interest for easier navigation. You can also access a tutorial for help you guide us. During this intro phase, points of interest will automatically be activated for you. Later, choosing navigation will be up to you. Can we cancel that? That would be a point of interest. Okay. Ah, a bit nipper. Not told more coming. Master's messy. Looking for sword? Talking rats. Right. This probably can't get any weirder. No offense, just never heard a rat talk before. They told me... They send pups for sword. Looking for sword? Probably. I should get something to train with. Yes. They not want you to destroy good blue steel, master. They give bronze first. Not as good metal, but master takes. Edgy, slim, and with a tan exactly my type. How did you know? I give you best fun I have. Only one bronze left, so it's easy. The same for complementary shield. Complementary? That's a complicated word. No, I did something. not say master. You did? Must hurt somewhere. Sorry. The Boro took straight, master. Now, sword one hand, shield another, and go train with other pups. Hope you'll be better than they. Okay. At least I hear this uh, whiny baby talk. Better. In your inventory menu, you can find your character screen where you can equip and unequip items, check your stats, and learn more about them. Sword, shield. I feel good. We'll follow the protocol and start easy. This is that rat shit was. Wait a minute, I. <laughs> you are funny. It's just rats. We don't consider it killing. Let's commence with your lesson. Rule one blows are best to be avoided. Perception and planning. Rule two if you can't avoid a blow, Use your shield for protection. That's it. Learning by doing and dying is my credo. 
Just don't forget to use your sword to deliver the execution. Hey, convict. Execution time. Yes, it is a convict. Okay, this is the guy that stole food. Okay, that's awful. style but you have delivered results let us proceed this one took part in the previous uprising it is strong vicious has the blood of many innocents on its paws looks clumsy but beware they have trained him well who did the racking renegade scum hiding in their stinking volcano killing our kid they all deserve to be executed Start with this one. Learn as much as you can in the process. Yeah. So Use all the skills you've acquired in the previous sparring session and focus on using the rolls to avoid stronger attacks. Here's a little healing help. Practice using it sparingly. I don't really feel like... Let's get this over. Down with it. <laughs> move. I said oh. move, you overgrown rat. First, uh, oh, I want to change the settings if I can. Second degree attack. What the hell? Okay, whatever. I just can't, I, I just can't stand this guy's voice. Sorry. rejuvenated that serves that child eating monster right the soul of my poor niece can now get well done silver you will be ready for the cradle and level soon cradle who is liberal i literally me and my premature informing focus we will discuss the fortress later first something to restore your health you will be in dire need of it very soon now it's time to commence the real training you will need some real weapons for that get them in the armory and come back Yeah, we're training to avenge his knees. Let's go. Okay. You're training to stay alive. You can't die, such as the power of your belt. But do you... You see those red pests around? Some of them got away and went wild. They started a strange fire cult. They hunt our people for meat and nibble them alive. Even children, or especially children. You know tender meat, juicy bones? My knees dip disappeared like that. Ugh. Not important, the rats are abominations. We suspect they might attack. I suppose you want to be served on a skewer anytime soon. They could gnaw your meat piece by piece and let the missing back bit bits grow back. It might take weeks before you would die and be reborn. So yes, you try to stay alive, but also undigested. And to help others keep their bodies intact too. So do your best. 
even though it probably won't be enough. Fink and do, brothers, just tell me. Shame. Here, yeah, take and go. You do your killing. I really hope you'll be different, but you like Nabaru after all. Yeah, well, I don't have a choice. We can choose to help those who make others suffer, we can choose to help those who suffer. Make sure you know what it's better. So, I guess uh, choices matter in this game. Some weapons, like training katana, you've just received are capable of casting spells or buffs instead of their secondary attacks. In the case of two-handed weapons and shields, this would take the place of a parry. You can find out what spells items contain by clicking on them in the inventory. Spells cast from items that require intellect grow more powerful with each skill point spent in intellect. Other times, items do not scale with the intellect. Each faction has mastered different schools of magic. Radkins use aggressive fire magic while Naboru manipulate void magic. It's unclear who wields lightning magic, as that has been discovered only recently. Need more help, like your guilty conscience? Uh, what about her knees? What from Tobias says it seems like your free kindred is kidnapped at 80 years old knees. Why should I help chill child murderers? We have big teeth, but we prefer vegetables. Dubai is just spreading lies. Oh. We just hate everybody because he lost his hand in war. He happy we his slaves and he can pester us. Oh, okay. You were dear servants, now they're slaves. You can see them. slaves dead. We're blind. Maybe they call us servants. But we slaves, devise tortures and kills. He laughing when putting colorful leash with fiery iron on our neck. Oh. What don't you do? We could always fight back or at least stand up for yourself. If you unleash your full potential, those are some pretty sharp teeth you've got. We scrub floors and fix meals and garden and give weapons. We know not another life. Sounds shitty. Let me get to know the ropes around here and I'll try to see what we can do about that tortures kill situation. Many burned and tortured by whiteies. <laughs> they keep medical kits hidden from us. Bring me one. Okay. Before the next fight, do I not have one in my inventory? restoration mile. Okay, so where the heck am I gonna find a medic? So what do we have here? 103, well pretty sure that's not a distilling ship hold classification so some dates probably and this would be in a bar I guess although using computers communicators this doesn't add up actually this whole scene looks pretty high-tech like a new spaceship launch party or an open house at a new research base which is crazy so either it's not the or this place was buzzing with technology back in the days curious well it certainly isn't buzzing now Interesting lore to figure out. Now that I don't hear this jerk. Hey. Hey stranger, sorry about Brian. How did the training go? How you feel? Happy about to be immortal? What do you make of all this? Whoa. Can we take those one at a time? Still kind of trying to figure this place out. Oh yes, yeah, sorry. I know I come here a bit much sometimes. But hey, no worries. I know the feeling all too well. What do you remember? For me there was light, and then there's ugly mushy face of some kind, and a fa fast flash, or maybe a reflection, and pain. And that's it, all my memories, super hazy, how about you? 
Yeah, I remember some woman screaming and then something killed me, I guess. Sounds a bit similar to yours, actually. Which is weird. That Maltus guy told me that mine was only a hallucination. Maybe a collective one, then. No, I'm serious. This might mean we know more than he says. Well, he surely knows more, but he's not also telling. Believe me, I tried. I guess that's the real reason the Whiteys call themselves the Keepers. Maybe I'll go and ask him. Well, have fun. Good news, though. He probably won't kill you. I mean, just for asking. Probably. Yeah. You wouldn't guess... Get his hands dirty. He has to buy us for killing us softly. Or at least we can't really. Something. Well, that's also something I'm still quite lost about. Okay. So I have some sort of sword now and a shitty seal. Anything I should know about this training thing? Well, you're all set and ready, I guess. I can't wait to see how cute you are. Okay. Oh, and just uh, try to stay clear of Marco. Cool. Cool, cool. Anything new to learn? We don't already know. I guess this is Brian. Let's see if I can find a health kit. Okay, there's the dude with the secrets. That's outside. Is that a chest up there? Was that just a, a light? Okay, so I can't jump. So there's no jumping, there's just this moving forward. This is where we're gonna escape. It looks like it. Glad I could turn the voice down because his voice is just awful. This must be Marco. The way in the world will I find a health potion? It's a nice place. Okay. The fragment of legendary axe. on the bed that's beautiful as far as uh, the the graphics go this game is absolutely stunning this main character is uh, disappointing I would have much rather chosen my own medical kit there we go this would definitely not be the character I would choose. I mean, first of all, his voice is just awful. I'm sure somebody likes it, I don't. And his character is just so whiny. Master, 
You bring medicine for injured brothers? Yes. So that medical kit gift. Sorry. Uh, this is all I could get. What do I do? Yes. Yes. Thank you. No. Okay. Ooh. Everybody equal friends of our kin. More equal. <laughs> Red volution, okay. On behalf of red what? Shh, red volunteers. That's how they call us. A lot of irony around, but not where you go train, okay. Be good. Go, go. So he's given me a, something better, a better shield. Because I'm not a heal, but he is. Mm. Okay, so Q is heal. Gotcha. I see you already. Good, it's time for the next step. You will train with your human counterparts. I suppose you wonder why. Not really. The idea of having not... Mm, yeah, good. You might think that challenging the burial or rats might be beneficial for you. True, the chances you will fight other humans are slim. But with them you can always fight to the death. It's proven to bring the best results. And since none of you can really die, death is merely a technicality. It sounds like a rather painful technicality. So yeah. The best way to learn in the short time we have, no second chances, no room for errors. Perfect, let's spar with Marco. Go, go. Ah. Well, at least you can get rid of that skull. He's got a bigger sword, doesn't he? And he's got a bigger health bar. Yeah. I should just uh, get a sword. Oh, jeez. He heals as well. Sure. Yeah. This new hope needs to be reported immediately. You have to inform the Patriarch. Yeah, really looking forward to being subtly insulted over and over again. Yeah. No, he will be more than pleased. Take this. Go. Right, what is it? My lucky ring. Toughened in the hell of war. Take it and go. Go, go, go. Report to the new to mortis. Excuse me. Okay, how did we find it? It's here, wasn't it? Yes. Ah, the prodigal we oh, prodigal weekly, whatever. Me, nothing honestly. Tobias just says hello. Are you toying with my patience? Oh, sorry. He also said that I should, quote, report this new hope immediately. What kind of new hope? Uh, it seems I'm not a weakling after all. I knocked out Marco and also Tobias' socks off while I was at it. Impossible. I would need to see it with my own eyes. What was that? Oh, lowly the queen as a...
Expect the Ori critter to do his respective missions and come back. We will keep Soy. He is not ready. Right now, when the time is right, sneak out and acquire the rod. Add the lightning rod to the armory. On the Majesty, I don't understand. What? Silent, you low life. You have broken your vows. Oh dear. Oh, that's a naughty boy. You know you're hiding forbidden technology and dear gracious, follow the procedures. We first need to acquire proof to support your claims. Patriarch, our guards are probing your premises rigorously. And if they find anything unorderly. Oh boy, Patriarch Maltus has ordered you to hide the lightning rod. Sneak your way into the shrine. We spoke to Bias, grab the rod and get to the armory. We spoke with the rat. When an enemy is about to spot you, a threat indicator will pop on your screen. If you stay in enemy's line of sight, it'll grow red until it becomes bright red. At that point, the enemy will spot you and attack you. In this case, if you let the threat indicator grow bright red, cards will quickly overpower you. Even if you get caught, don't worry and remember, there's no wrong playthrough in this game. Alrighty. Okay, so I need to sneak. That way, oh no, 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 stop right there. Unlikely and earthling, our dear Gra Gracious was right. We have brought you here to show you the glory of Wardenia and remind you the world, once or orderly, is distorted. We will need answers fast and don't try to fool us. Like our dim water half brother, we don't dwell on old legends. Now, just silence. Why did you appear here? What do you bring to our tormented people? I love the crown. I have no idea, that's what I was trying to tell you. I have no clue whatsoever about what's going on here. My memory is one black hole and nobody tells me anything like that. I wish your royal breath on these traitors. Legends. We can't and won't rule by legends, Marshal. We are not our delusional semi-siblings. We shall seek the truth first, then we proceed to justice. Earthling, we had no idea you were kept in oblivion. We presume that the keepers have tried to make you part of their schemes. Rest assured that nothing you were told here is true. Ghastly things are now vexing our realm. Twisted abominations, lightning weapons, rat lurks in the shadows waiting for us to become weak. I spit on the stingy rats and their graves. Silence. We are here to put those monstrosities to a halt. Tell us, Earthling, were you aware that you were involved in a traitorous plot to overthrow your queen? Oh, my queen. I honestly had no idea. All they ever told us was to train. We thought so. We are still keen to discuss your involvement later. Now we have pressing matters to deal with. Maltus, you are hereby found guilty of treason. There is no mercy in our hearts for those who betray the way of Anabora. Still, we don't want to disturb the people more by beheading a patriarch. Yet. You will be imprisoned here until we decide your fate. As for you, Tobias, we value your loyalty and your battle scars. Now would be the time to confess. Or should we have the whole monastery thoroughly searched? Our men would surely find a secret passage or two, giving them enough time. I believe us, our present rage is nothing compared to the havoc that would be wreaked upon your head then. Speak up, or... Majesty, behold, the fortress is under attack. Rats again, how unsurprising, yet unsettling.
Turkish can't hold the fortress effectively with the limited crew he has. You take two more men, stay here and make sure nobody leaves this place. And give them what they deserve. I shall deserve a fair investigation, dear gracious. You, Marshal, and the rest of the guard shall follow us to the fortress. Let's squash the pestilent rat rebellion and feed the bodies to his bed. Then we shall return to investigate further. Oh, nuts. After a few hours in the monastery cellar. A few hours later. Another rat attack after all these years. So unfair. Mourning the traitors for us. All the real fun for all of us still. He won't get out mud with his fancy arm. When I substitute the rat. He would be dead. <laughs> Where's that thing again? Just drag Maltus away. He's unbeaten, bleeding, and hurting, but not blind. Do you realize it is all your fault? How could you fail with such an easy task? Well, run and fetch the rod, bring it to me. If you weren't for your failure, we wouldn't be here. Well, screw you, dude. Next time, do things. Sure, only that you will be dead as soon as you leave this prison. Even better, you will keep painfully dying indefinitely, so there'll probably justice in the world after all. Oh, well, screw you about that quasar. You're not worthy, spare me. I'm in pain. Leave me alone. Yeah, sure, Joe. Totally leave you alone. Coverage will be sufficient to make the belt work properly almost everywhere. With the last update, the belt is now fully operative. Also, a life support system, meaning if I get killed, it revives me. Marvelous. This should provide me with enough leverage when dealing with those Navarro technocrats. I will recall was never easy. Even after the ship's training system uploaded the same language to our brains. So this should help if the discussions get heated. Note, aging is still a factor, so not fully immortality. Focus on possibility to revert to a younger physical self while retaining all the information later when there's time. Project will help, mixed results. My hard light companion is operative and proves useful for simple tasks. I still wasn't able to grant him fuller autonomy. To fix this, extend the range to make useful for long distance errand. Add a mouth and basic AI for easier communication feedback. I wish I could awake the rest of the crew. The 
mission seems to be gravely endangered. And Ada insists that the protocol doesn't allow for that, says we lost enough of the personnel already. True, but the logic behind her reasoning seems flawed. This way she might lose me too. Oh well. Now back to work. I need to learn a lot about this place. Okay. You can add second player into the game by selecting split screen in the terminal menu or by plugging another device in the menu. Enjoy an extra bit of fun with your co-player. Live through the entire story together, find the ideal character build combinations, and once each other's spell effects and deal with various situations in ways that are not possible in a single player mode. As Silver's hologram, you can level up only until you reach the level of the main player. You won't be able to interact with other characters nor influence the story, but on the other hand, you can focus entirely on combat. You have accumulated enough essence to grow in power. Enter level up menu by clicking on the level up button and invest your essence into increasing character stats of your choice. Okay, so that thing that uh, killed us was his minion that he made. Ooh, hello. And... Oh my gosh. The phone appears back. Honestly, still might mo make a good rodent. You have a knack for surviving. This is cool. Thank you, I guess. We might have an interesting offer for you if you find you worthy of the task. But tread lightly. My brothers weren't too keen of this idea. They wouldn't hurt you, but I wouldn't get too close. Now follow me. There's a lot to explain, and the fire is burning hot already. Revolution. Okay. Eye for an eye, tooth for two is life for a life. That's the justice of the revolution. You are now part of it. Okay. Yeah, now he talks properly. Didn't exactly sign up, but I get that you're angry. Maybe you should well take it easy. They didn't take it easy. Sure, maybe tyrants should suffer. Tyrants have to suffer, they need to feel the storm, the whirlwind, and the earthquake of freedom. Yeah, that's not kind of how it works. Just the endless cycle. Tobias, yeah, well, he was a jerk to us, wasn't he? Was that the lightning rod thing? They stuck somebody's head on it. Or was the lightning rod gone already? I'm not sure. Let's equip that. 
It's a better ring to me, actually. So there's a rat outside the door. Dude. Yeah, you do a lot of dope stuff. Uh, kill. Kill. Well, oh, you did train me to kill, didn't you? straight out of his clothes. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, it is done. Respect the revolution. Yes, it's dead. Our snobby siblings prefer to call themselves Perkins, but we have proudly embraced our inner rats. And you are one of us now. Welcome to the Ratkin Revolutionary Army, my friend. You seem to have a great respect for the Rat Revolution. You are hereby promoted to corporal. Seems to be. You already have ranks? Indeed, and also a new mission for you, corporal. Our army desperately needs equipment. And Tobias has a secret room in the armory. Let me guess, you want that electric stick everybody seems to be crazy about? No, not the stick of thunders. You can have it, if you want. It's unnatural, against our faith. The fiery Marvius, may his ash find peace, bless us with fire, not with lightning. But there are other wonders in the armory. Now I'm intrigued. I wonder what other wonders are. There are swords, razor sharp, behind the secret door. Cut through Navarro armor as if it was just baby rat fur. Uh, we can't find a key, maybe Tobias had it on him. Take what you want. Bring me those swords. They gave them to Marka, I need them now to give the army that extra edge. Yeah, sure. Let's go and rescue the ratties. Because there's a there's a secret door right there.
That's kind of sad. It's a it's a very sad looking armory. This. Okay, let's see what I picked up. Uh, fire katana. That's probably what he wants. Machete. I didn't see the fire stick though. The lightning rod. Okay. The monastery is ours now. Safe space of justice. Yet we can't wait to kill more. Yeah, get rid of some short, short swords. Plates on our enemies just turned into paper. Are you really sure that wrath and justice mix well? I'm promoted to captain. Mubara said you were guiding a ship. Was I? They didn't say more about that? Not really, and there's no time to dwell on the past. We should decide where to take the revolu rat revolution next. We should join forces with the rat army at the fortress. Our brothers, they could probably use our help, and we can catch them to borrow off guard. Um, let me just grab a few more things first. This is a So that's that door opened. I think it was just that door.
to see if there's anything else. Suppose if I did get it right to sneak, we would have probably um, gotten through that hole, I suppose, yeah. So the fire katana seems to spoon mine. Let's see the country. It's a superior training katana. That one's better. Because I know we did give him the fire katana. Okay. Well, let's uh, just speak to him and tell him we are ready to go. Okay. Let's go. How do we get there? There's a ship down the bay that keeps used to get the provisions here. We don't know how to sail, but since you were captain, it shouldn't be a problem for you, right? Sure. No problem, say less my middle name. Not the fucking sailor. <laughs> oh, that is funny. Oh, well, so there's hidden paths in the game if you listen carefully. That's awesome.
goat on my head. That's a pretty, pretty cool looking ship, I must say. I actually thought that was the end of the dinner, but it seems not. So we shall carry on a smooth sailing, Captain. The landing on the other pool. I was just curious about the old saying, Captain Rats and Sinking Ship, and you really were much faster than I was. If you were in a borrow, I would kill you for that joke. That's disrespectful of Ratkins, but also very funny. <laughs> That's a problem with jokes in general. What shall we do now, though? Simple, we get inside and kill as many as in the bar as we can. Right, and how do we get in? Simple, go through the sewers and open the gate from the inside. For well, you shall march swiftly to places where you are not expected. We will hide in the meantime to strike unexpectedly. Right. Uh, be careful, borrow boofers kept a spider. Oh uh, my, no. That spider. It's not like it could kill you, really. Can you go with me? Why don't you just march swiftly through the sewers with me? We could, but we'd rather not. I should prepare our brothers for the battle, boost them morale and such. Right. Also, there's that spider. The rat can suffer from the Bracknell failure. Well, it's certainly better than if you go, Captain. Because I can't die, that's what you say. Alrighty. painful. Very, very painful. Ooh, he's got a pew pew. I want a pew pew. I want your pew pew. You have received a mana drainer. Equip the mana drainer in your shield slot and perform left hand primary or secondary action to hit your enemies and convert their life energy to your mana. from behind like that. Ugh, webs. Cool. Webs. <laughs> Did it just kill itself? I hope it just killed itself. We have a mission. Is it again? It's just you and me. Not a word to anybody. Oh. 
Okay, that spider just knocked itself out. Please say it.
son of a bitch. Red mage on. Who's, who was attacking? I just saw a red thing. Let's go kill those other guys that did me. So I was looking for another way into that door. Percent fire and 100 percent lightning, 100 percent arrow blocking. Okay, that's better. Superior swords. This is a bit of salt. Can't use that one because I don't have the right level. Fire stuff. Okay. That makes me a little bit less squishy. So we can go this way and we can go the other way. Let's go this way first. I have no idea how long, how much. Uh, oh, hello, dude. He's a laxmith. Just got me smithing in the heat of war, forging a new sword after midnight. <laughs> nope. I don't care about your walls, not anymore. Why don't you run away then? This is my forges. Human, yesterday, old wife's tale, today, every man's enemy. Okay. You have received a blacksmith's kit. Now you can upgrade and dismantle various equipment at any terminal. You're not as skilled as an actual blacksmith, so you need more materials. Wood, iron, bronze, and cloth are easily obtainable with basic materials. But in the game, you can also find other, more rare resources for crafting advanced weapons and armor. Awesome. looking great.
see the lights at all. Could it be this side? Flying shield. A mind. I can't see all the stuff it has to. But it does look pretty damn cool. I should have checked what that other thing was that we picked up for oh, this thing. Oh, we need five. We need five eyes. Oh, somebody sees me. Do these guys just come back? <coughs> Seems so. Ah! <laughs> 
Since you must retrieve it before you die again. Um, I'm gonna get that right. I dropped down this thing. Scales of the battles and favors of brothers. I wish I, I could have chastised our nemesis, punishing the exit, but um, yeah, get rid of him at last. Fortress will be good pause from now on. Sure, sure. Revolution. I was listening to secure the local sanctum. Secure meaning ransack. Mm hmm. Potato, potato. Always keep the most interesting thing to themselves, medicine and such. Be a shame if they were lost in the heat of the battle. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We need to bring fire to the limit to the city. Let's do that. Spider. I don't have to deal with the spider.
totally didn't even see these roads. It's dead. say he wanted uh, to find his body. Okay, this is the we have there. Let's let's dance dude. Too slow. Too slow. Too slow. Too slow. Thank you. 
check what we've picked up. Proofuses. Bands of proofuses. Yes, that's where I lose. A red mage is not very good. It's good against fire. Fragment of the legendary axe. Where's that other weapon we picked up? So we need 10 strength to wield it. Okay. I suppose if we equip another ring, we could, but I like the one we've got. It gives me kind of a, an overall increase of everything. Maybe if I was playing co op and the other person could focus on something different, but what I'm focusing on, and that would be useful then. If one person could be rage and, and mage. Or I take it. You traitor. Not a traitor. Neutralizer. Try to aim for his belt. Mm, and he runs away. What a wuss. the text is down to the child. Okay, we shall come back here. I'm gonna go and explore.
beautiful color. Dodge keep you close to an enemy for a quick counter attack. It doesn't have an invincible frame like the roll. I don't even know how to do the roll. Ew. Oh boy. Ooh, damn it. Just open another door to the same place. Makes no sense. Okay. Oh damn, the pain, it hurts so much. Help him, please. Let's help him. We see those wounds. Away, you know, Boris labor. I kill Boris Bufus me with my bare paws. We toss him his pet spider. Like he tossed bodies of ratkins, he tortures to death first. Freedom. I die happily now. I'm not the borrow, I'm a human, and I'm with the ratkin army. Really? You bring help? I do. How come you're so badly hurt? Boofers fight back, and we all fall in spider pit. Two brothers die, I barely survive, but Boofus is dead. Now I die, I want to die. Spider poison killing me. Oh dear. Options with exclamation marks are quest buttons, which are very likely to make the story progress, and close off other dialogue options. Options with dialogue bubble symbols are talk buttons that can uncover many details about each character, the overall story, and word lore. They can also lead you to new optional quests. Awesome. Do it, I kill the spider. Where is he? Where is he? 
antidote. There's a plan, you can't lie around you. Okay, awesome. So you can join us. Okay, thank you. So you gave me a ring, it was Bufus's ring. Awesome. He opened a door for me. If you did like it, please um, don't forget that smack that like button. Don't forget to smack the like button. There is a link down below if you enjoyed this game and want to wishlist it or go and buy it. I do like it except for this guy's whiny attitude and voice. <laughs> that just killed it. Uh, I had to turn down the voices. I, I just couldn't. But yeah. It's a very, very nice game otherwise. Absolutely loved it. So yeah, if you're not subscribed, please do so. It really helps me. And uh, hit that uh, notification button if you want to see the next video or when I go live again. Until then, have a wonderful evening, afternoon or morning, wherever you are. And I shall catch you on the next one.